This video will show you how to populate a ProPresenter playlist on Production One with the necessary graphics, screens, and videos for a Sunday morning worship service. Each Sunday has a few elements to its ProPresenter playlist. Up in the top right hand corner you have announcement slides, live slides, and videos, special videos, video announcements, sermon notes, lower thirds, these are titles for our pastors on stage, and worship backgrounds. Most weeks you're only populating this announcement slide folder, live slide folder, and videos folder. How you do that is on the left side of the screen there are corresponding folders that are linked to OneDrive. These are folders that our graphics designer puts into, our IT director puts into, our video editor puts into. So the first thing you do is open up your announcement slides folder from OneDrive and see what they've given you for the week. This window will be full of announcements that will go in your pre and post announcements for ProPresenter. You'll simply take these and drag them over to this folder. Next, you'll have live slides. This is also a folder that our graphic designer puts into. You'll open this, select the folders, the files, drag into. Now it's on Production One's computer. Videos, same thing. Select the videos, drag them over to the videos folder. These are our video announcements. You'll want to click in that. Whichever one has been loaded for the week, drag that into videos as well. Now sometimes you'll have special sermon notes from a special guest speaker drag that into your sermon notes folder and these are miscellaneous graphics if you get special direction. This folder we'll talk about at the end of the video. Alright, all your folders are loaded with the graphics. Now you open ProPresenter, click on video image, and all of these folders right here are what we call hot folders. That means that they are directly connected to anything you have put or stored in these folders here. If you've put a video in the videos folder, you can click on the video tab there and it will be found somewhere in here and obviously you can drag and drop to the playlist. Now when you finished with the entire playlist, the last thing you do is hit File, Export Playlist, date it, and save it. I'm going to save it to the desktop so that you can see something. So we have just exported this entire playlist with all of its included videos, folders, files, everything. Here it is. Last step, you want to drag this over to your last folder. This is the ProPresenter playlist for the West Lafayette campus. That allows them to use the same playlist. And that's it.